And today I'm going to show you how to create a Windows 10 recovery disk on a flash drive. Now I'm going to be using this SanDisk flash drive here. This is a 32 gigabyte drive, but it's not necessary to have one that big. A 16 gig will work just fine. So make sure you have at least a 16 gig flash drive. All right, so I'm just gonna take this guy out. Then we'll just insert our flash drive. Now we can come over here where it says type here to search. Click in there and type in recovery. R-E-C-O-V-E-R-Y. And this comes up. Now this says create a recovery drive. So click on that. Click on yes. And not only is this a recovery drive, you can also use it to reinstall Windows. And I'm going to select this where it says backup system files to the recovery drive. Click on next. Okay, so it took a couple minutes for it to collect all the data that it needs. And then it says here that the drive must be able to hold at least 16 gig of data and everything on the drive will be deleted. And it found my D drive, which is my sand disk. And to verify that, I can click here. I can bring up the drive tools and you'll see here that it says USB drive D. And I will click on next. It says everything on the drive will be deleted. If you have any personal files on this drive, make sure you back them up. Click on create. Okay, so it completed. So if we bring up our file explorer, Go to the recovery drive. You'll see that we now have a boot folder, EFI folder, sources, window volume information, boot manager, boot, NXT, and a regent.xml.